When a social security worker dies, the surviving dependents are eligible to receive benefits on the deceased person's work record. One of the qualifying dependents is the current or former spouse of the deceased worker, who must meet certain requirements to be eligible for benefits. A current or former spouse of a deceased beneficiary receives survivor benefits on the deceased record as early as age 60. A qualifying spouse must have been married to the deceased worker for at least 9 months for a current spouse or at least 10 years for a divorced spouse. The age of marriage rule does not apply if the surviving spouse or former spouse is caring for a minor child of the deceased worker. If the surviving spouse has attained the full retirement age, he slash she can receive 100% of the benefits the deceased spouse was receiving or was eligible to collect. If the surviving spouse claims surviving benefits between age 60 and the full retirement age, they can receive between 71.5% to 99% of the deceased benefits. If the surviving spouse is disabled, he slash she can claim benefits at age 50 and receive 71.5% of the deceased spouse's benefits. If the surviving spouse is caring for a minor child under 16 or a disabled child, he slash she can collect 75% of the deceased spouse's benefits. Subscribe to Beagle for more informative videos like this.